step shit, have you wildin' Last minute trips to the islands Trip, trip, trip when you're sliding Welcome back to my channel and it's your girl my Asian Chanel and in this video of course I'm going to show you guys what is in my diaper bag and what I carry when I'm basically on the go and I have the baby with me. So yes, if you are a new mama or you have a baby or you just enjoy mommy content, definitely keep on watching and don't forget to hit the like button after you finish watching the video and leave a comment and let me know if it's anything that I should add in my diaper bag or anything that you add in your diaper bag that I should definitely look into. So if you're interested, definitely keep on watching and let's just get right into it. Okay, so we're going to jump right into the video. So this is the diaper bag that I use. It's just my mic, my, oh. It's just my Marc Jacobs bag. I have a video on here of what's in my purse. And I just decided to turn this purse into my baby bag. So it has it has um like this strap if you want to put it on your shoulder. And then it has the long strap if you want to do it like cross the body. So it looks like that. And I'll definitely link like what's in my purse video. If anyone is interested and you haven't seen it, I'll definitely link it in the video. Sorry, I have something in my bag. I'll definitely link it in a video somewhere in here. So let's just jump right into it. So the first thing I'm going to show y'all is just the bib. So this is one of the bibs. This is like more of a heavy duty, more sturdy bib. So like if he has to spit up or once he starts drooling, this will work really well. And it won't like wet his whole entire bib. Then he has, I think the rest of them are like at the bottom. Hold on. So then he has these two other ones. So he has another one more sturdy like the first one. He has this one in white. And those bibs came from Amazon. I think I had got like a pack of 12. Um, I'll definitely link where I got those from because those bibs are actually really good. He is more on a smaller size. So it's a little big for him. But I still use those bibs. Now this one is from H&M. These ones I feel like fit him the best because they're not so big. But the downside about this is this cloth material is so thin that if he spits up and stuff, it tends to get really wet. So that's the downside about the H&M bibs. Next, I have his swaddle. He is such a swaddle baby. He loves to be swaddled. That's like his big thing. So I added the swaddle just in case, like let's say if I'm gonna go to someone's house or I'm gonna be just there long and he's like a little fussy and I can't get him to go to sleep or if he's with his dad and there's somewhere, he has like his swaddle just to kind of relax him and soothe him. These swaddles, they don't come in packs. It's just like a one. It looks like a little um, sleeping bag. And it has the zipper. The size I have for this swaddle is newborn. Um, I love the material of it. It's really nice. But I need to actually actually maybe spray this down because he like stained it. Um, but yeah, so it just says be careful with the swaddle. It's a suffocation hazard. And stop swaddling when the baby can roll over from back to stomach. So of course you should stop swallowing your baby swaddling your baby not swallow swaddling swaddling your baby then so this is this this is a swaddle i love this swaddle it's so cute um of course i have just some t-shirts so like some undershirts for him i have this one which is in preemie because he's super small it's just a long sleeve undershirt in case he like spits up he has a poop explosion um or we take off his clothes i don't know and then i have this one which is and newborn which he actually is starting to fit a lot of his newborn stuff now so i'm super happy about that so he also has that one in newborn okay so he has since we're on clothes i'm just gonna finish on the other clothes so i have an outfit in here um <laughs> i have to actually switch this out but the outfit that i did have in the bag was this one it was just this h&m like um sweatshirt that i had in here for him and i had his or i have his like little bottom that goes to the outfit so this is in here and that's like in case whatever he has on messes up and i'm going to change him i'm just going to switch him out to that outfit and actually those hold on that's the wrong outfit whatever take that out but yeah i have that outfit right there i have his pacifier now this is the only pacifier he likes is the event what nub <laughs> But his little Jeffrey, his little um, giraffe, we call him Jeffrey. This is his little Jeffrey. That's like his favorite pacifier. But he's not a pacifier baby. So he has to like really be frustrated to honestly use the pacifier because that's like really not his vibe. But yeah, I do have that pacifier just in case. As well as I have four things of diapers. So he has four diapers. This is just the Huggies 
um little snugglers in a size newborn i have like four of these in here because honestly if i'm out i don't plan to be out like that long with him so he has about four i have some pampers swaddlers not swaddlers but look at me swaddlers i'm stuck pampers um i guess just regular pampers wipes this is good for travel i have these in here um but typically i do normally use water wipes on him but these are the ones that i do just keep in the bag we have some a and c ointment just in case because you never know when you could be a little irritated so we have a and c in here what else oh okay so i have this which is really cool because i know you're looking like why is a weapon up probably not like in the in the cupboard or something this is really hard for me to fit in like the little pacifier holder so i have to kind of leave it like this but i do of course always sanitize it and keep it clean as well as i have these munchkin pacifier wipes so these are really good if your child does use like the pacifier or maybe even if the bottle falls or something these are really good to just have in the bag just in case i also have some aqua four in here <laughs> i don't know in case his skin is dry or it gets irritated and the A and Z is not doing it, I have the Aqua 4. So I have Aqua 4 in the back as well. I have a little thing of Vaseline. This is like mainly for me. This is the Vaseline Lip Therapy and Rosy Lips. This is just for my lips when they get dry and stuff. I have his little pacifier holder. I, I did buy more pacifiers like the Wub Nub that I actually got yesterday. I just haven't added them into the bag and stuff. But I do have this holder. And I have this other pacifier he got from the hospital. He's like really not even... Ooh, he's like not crazy about it. It's similar to the to ones that I bought him. Like the Wub Nub style. It's just a lot smaller. Like the nipple. And hold on because he's crying. Okay and lastly I just have some mittens for him. That looks like this. Just a pair of mittens. I usually don't put mittens on him but... Whew, I'm out of breath. <laughs> I guess I mean it's just in case. But yeah, guys, that's going to conclude for what's in my diaper bag video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It's super quick. Not a whole lot of stuff. I feel like by the second to third baby, you get really experienced. You know exactly what you need, what you don't need. So yeah, these are just all the products that I feel like I need. Um, so yeah, if it's anything I'm missing, definitely don't forget, like I said, to comment down below. What you think I should add. Don't forget to follow me on all my socials. They're always going to be linked in the description bar. Box. Not bar. I don't know why I always say bar. In the description box. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Hit the post notification bell. So you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. And I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Later mamas. Do this for hours. And hours. And hours. I could do this for hours.